Hi. This video and for the next maybe almost a year, um, I am going to be sharing my experience with the Orbera gastric balloon. Today is June the um, 11th, 2017. My procedure is scheduled for Thursday the 15th. So I just cut um, like three or four more days. Um, really quick uh, background is I've always been overweight. Um, I've tried everything you can think of. All the little diets, all the things. Um, I have three children. It seems like with each pregnancy I gained more and more. Um, after my second pregnancy, I took like fentiramine and some B12 shots and I lost a lot of weight, like 60 pounds. And celebration, I went and got myself a tummy tuck. I was pregnant within a year from that. So that was like $11,000 down the drain. Um, got After that pregnancy, I got down to pretty close to my um, same weight. But still, that's like in the 160s. I mean, that was like, that was good for me. Um, I think, look, logged on today to my, that My Fitness Pal or the app, and I noticed that um, I had a record of my logins from a long time ago. So, like, this has been a gradual incline, is why I'm deciding to do this now. In, um, so in July 2012, uh, July 2012, I was 170. August 2014, I was 185. June 2015, I was 193. January 2017, I was 198. And June 2017, I'm 203. Wow. And it's just going to keep getting worse, apparently. Um, so, first of all, for every person that's watching this, um, judging me, saying, Oh my God! You're paying $6,000 to have a balloon placed in your stomach. Why don't you just go on a diet? Okay, well, I've tried. Hello? Um, I have tried. I really have. Obviously, I don't have willpower or something, but I've tried. Um, so anyways, I am having the Orbera balloon placed um, on this coming Thursday. Um haven't really told a lot of people. My husband, close friends and family know. Um, but I will tell people because there's there's got to be more people like me that have um, literally struggled, struggled our entire life. And um, maybe this will, you know, it's, it's, they go over and over. This is not a magic pill. All this does is um, I'm going to be doing nutritional um, counseling and, and meeting with like meeting with a dietitian monthly, seeing my doctor monthly. Um, this basically takes up some of the space in my stomach so I don't starve to death while I'm trying to retrain my brain on um, proper portion control, I guess. Um, in conjunction with that, I am doing um, um, it's a Bible Bible based made to crave. Um, by Lisa Turkerst. I can't say it. But anyways, um, you know, I'm going to do multiple, like a holistic approach to all of this. Um, very excited, very nervous, because a lot of the research that I've seen has been a lot about vomiting, and I literally hate the sensation of vomiting. I I hate it. You know, they say that there's that euphoric feeling that some people get. It ain't happening here. That euphoric feeling that people will get when they're jogging. Mm -mm. It ain't happening here. So, anyways, yes. So I'm having a balloon placed in my stomach to um, to get a jump start to help prevent diabetes and everything else that goes along with it besides on top of everything else I'm actually I'm a nurse and I educate um, in some of the homes it just depends on, on the person but sometimes I have to teach about uh, obesity and here I am a, an obese nurse teaching patients on how not to be obese okay that's not good um, but this is a decision that I made for myself there's even a, a possibility that I won't lose anything at all. 
that's a possibility my doctor told me that but um i'm going to do my best and if i can help anybody out there um that's had the same problems then that would be an awesome thing too so i will probably follow you up and um, check back with you guys on thursday after the procedure has been done take care